Hello viewers, welcome to our channel. In this video, we will show you how to create a chart for Excel dashboard. It's a fully dynamic chart which is best fit for a dashboard. So let's start to make the Excel chart for dashboard. First of all, we'll create a chart for item X. We'll go to insert and we'll create a donut chart. We'll select the chart and in shape fill, we'll give a transparency level to 100%. Then we'll select the series. We'll change the angle slice. And we'll reduce the whole size. We'll right click and we'll give no outline to the series. Right click on that series and give no fill. Go to format, shape fill and change the fill color. Here I am giving it a purple color. Go to insert. And bring this shape and place it here. With the exact position. Go to format. And give a white color outline. Increase the width of the outline and change it purple color. Again, go to home, insert, shape, and bring another round shape. Try to make it larger than the donut chart. Give no outline and in fill, give pure white color. In shape effect, give out a shadow effect. Now send it to back. So the chart will look like this. Again, go to insert and bring this shape. Connect it with this item X data of 2020, which is 20%. Now just format the data, give in a shadow effect, change the color. Here you connect the item name with the title which is X, give a shadow effect. And give a shadow effect for all the shapes and item. Make it a group. Now just copy this and make one more copy. Resize it smoothly and resize it once more to best match. And make two more copies. And one after another will be smaller than the previous one. And for the third one, change the angle of the slicer. Now select the second chart and change the data series because that was previously selected for item X. Now make it to item Y and do this respectively for all the charts. After that, change the color as like as we did in the first chart. Give no fill for this series and here give a respective color that you like. I'm giving here pure green color. Do this for all the shapes in that chart and continue this for all the charts that we have. Change the linking for data labels and for chart titles X with X, Y with Y, Z with Z, and L with L. Also change the percentage 
format the data as the data formatting will go out when the data series will be changed. We'll do the same thing for all the shapes for all the shapes and chart now send this shape to backward and bring this shape just forward so it will have a balance now place it properly and make all of them into a group so it's became a single chart now if you just change the year the data will be changed accordingly now the chart is ready to use it in an excel dashboard this is all about this video if you have enjoyed the video then don't forget to subscribe our channel and check out our other series for more attractive chart and dashboard videos